Okay, it's work day out here at the barn. The problem is I got a leak on the tractor. This is the arm that hooks up the three-point hookup. The shaft right down here. You can see it's got a shaft sticking out and a little beveled piece there. Well, inside that little bevel piece is a seal. Well, the only way to get it out is pull that whole bottom piece off of here and tear it apart and press it out from the inside or do it like I did. And I slid that shaft back in and looked at the seal and figured I could pull it out from the outside. So I had to make me a tool. I'll show you what that looks like now. All right, here's the tool I made. This one I've already got out. The tool goes inside this piece and when it, you get it inside there, it falls into place. You slide this keeper in like that. That holds it in where it's behind it and it can't come out. Then I put the sleeve over the top of it. Brought the washer back. Made a puller out of it. And tightened that nut up on the end and pulled that piece here out from the outside without having to tear the whole tractor apart down there to get it out. This uh, piece here, don't want to come out of there. After you get it out of there, it's got the seal and that's the bad seal. I had to pop this plastic part of the seal out first to get it out of there so that it would have room for that end of this piece to drop down in that shoulder and get a hold of it. Here's the little ring on the outside of the seal I had to get out. There's the bad seal. And after looking at it, I found that it's got a little hairline black crack. You can see it right in there. And that's where the oil is leaking from, right? In that, where it's dark down in there, it's got a hairline crack in the seal. That's where it was all the oil was leaking out. I leaked probably five gallons of oil out over the last month just sitting around here. Every time I go out, there'd be a spot where I parked it. So it's time to change the seal. Anyway, that's my little project for today. Okay. <clears throat> this is the problem. I got a shaft seal leaking. You can see the shaft, I stuck it out on this side. It'll push out both ways. The shaft is... Uh, seal is leaking on the other side, so I had to sh slide it out this way. I'm going to get down here, set it up where you can see it here. And I had to pop out the seal out of the inside of it so I could uh, This is a seal that I popped out of there on the inside. I had to make me a special tool to go in and pull this piece out. The tool looks like this. I had to make a special puller. And this goes in the hole. And after it goes in the hole, it drops down in 
behind that where that seal was in there. And then I got a keeper that slides in the hole over here in order to hold it in place. And after you do that, there's a sleeve that you have to put over the outside of it. Try to make a puller out of it. And the sleeve goes up and sets against the body of the tractor. Got a big washer there to set on the sleeve. And after you get it in place, And you take your wrench and you start cranking on it and you hear it snap there, pulling that piece out. And when it comes out of there, I'll be able to take and put a new seal in it and put it back in place and slide that shaft back over this way and get it through the seal and and I can fill this thing back up with the wall and be back in business. I've already done this to the other side about five or six months ago and it started leaking and I had to do it. So this is a tool that I made for the other side. And now I'm having to use it over here on this side. I don't know. Here it comes. There's a piece. There's where the seal goes in right there. That seal that came out of here, I had to destroy it to get it out of there. But the seal, after getting it out, I noticed there was a black spot on it. And you can see it right there. There's a crack in the seal. That's where the oil was leaking out. Right through that little hole right there so I got to go tomorrow and get a new seal and put this thing all back together and then I'll be back in business again <laughs>